president campaigned on binding up the wounds of the country and restoring norms. And I'm wondering, two years in, if the president believes that he has made progress in restoring the American public's faith in federal institutions. Well, one of the things that we understand and, and the president understands, and I've been asked this question in different variations, and it's pretty much the same. He, you know, when he, when he ran, he understood that we were in a politi politically polarized uh, environment. Uh, he understand that um, uh, it was going to be a lot of work uh, to bring people together. And I think the work continues. Uh, even in his first 18 months, uh, there's still a lot of work to be done. Uh, and, um, you know, but he has been able to do some things that people said he couldn't be, he couldn't do, right? But bipartisanship on the bipartisan infrastructure law, it brought the right and the, uh, you know, the R's and the D's, Republicans and Democrats together. That was because of this president's uh, leadership that he was able to do that, to deliver uh, an infrastructure uh, investment that was historical. Uh, he was able to, we were able to do that with the CHIPS, uh, CHIPS and Science Act, bring the two sides together to get something done, uh, to make sure that we're leaders uh, across the world when it comes to manufacturing. And so there are things that this president has done because of his leadership. Somebody was asking me about NATO. Uh, that is also important as well. It's NATO is the strongest that it's been uh, in modern times because of his leadership abroad. Uh, so uh, I think there's still more work to, to be done. It's not like turning the, the light switch on. And so we're going to continue to do the work. So there's no, there's no yes or no answer. We, there is we're going to continue uh, to work towards that. And then you've said repeatedly that the president learned of the news of the, the FBI visit to Mar-a-Lago the other day through news reports. Can you tell us anything more? Was he watching the news? Was he scrolling Twitter? Did someone in his staff flag it for him? I can tell you this, he was not uh, aware of, 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 uh, of, of the, uh, what was it, the Mar-a-Lago raid? I don't know what you guys are calling it, uh, uh, before it happened. So I can tell you so that did not know. Uh, he learned about it really like all of us did. I'm sure maybe someone on his team flagged it for him, but he was not aware. What I can tell you definitively and for sure, he was not aware of this. He was, we were, nobody in the White House was. We were not given a heads up, uh, and we did not know about uh, about what happened yesterday. 